Until the coronavirus is resolved, criminals take a break. Okay? Stay home. Okay? Stay home. And don't commit any crimes. And that way, they'll stay safe and out of jail. And police officers will stay safe and can go home to their families. Okay? So everybody chill. Crooks, criminals, you chill. Wait till the coronavirus is over. Why don't you explain to me why what I'm doing? Go the f home. I'm wondering if you see the potential, as some others in your party do, for a new progressive era. Yes. Forgive me for being long-winded, uh, but absolutely we see this as an opportunity to reshape uh, the way we do business and how we govern. Some states are still not issuing stay-at-home orders. I mean, whether there should be a federally mandated uh, directive for that or not, that, I guess that's more of a political question, but just scientifically, doesn't everybody have to be on the same page with this stuff? I, I think so, Anderson. I don't understand why that's not happening. I, as you said, you know, the tension between federally mandated versus states' rights to do what they want is something I don't want to get into, but if you look at what's going on, in this country, I just don't understand why we're not doing that. Basically what's happening in America is whatever happens when a family has like an alcoholic dad and then the kids just have to raise themselves, that's what's going on in the U.S. right now. Yeah, Trump is AWOL, so the kids are just like, all right, I, I guess I'm just going to drive to the supermarket, yeah? I want to talk about this new talk of an infrastructure bill in Congress. Are you taking into consideration uh, green jobs, green infrastructure? Yes, if we're gonna, look, the COVID-4 can probably be more forward-looking at the economy. And if we're gonna do infrastructure, cause there's nothing better than getting the infrastructure going and going in a big, strong way. We need it big, we need it bold, and we need it futuristic, which means green. The idea that any abortion isn't essential is medically irresponsible. Everyone has been instructed that if they see worship services going, uh, services going on, uh, they will go, uh, to the officials of that congregation, they'll inform them they need to stop the services and disperse. If that does not happen, they will take additional action up to the point of uh, fines and potentially uh, closing the building permanently. I just need to keep my mouth shut for a little while. <laughs>